Bold, Brave and Better is a framework I've developed that allows people and teams to find clarity about what really matters, build creative confidence and make deeper connections. It is about unlocking your creative potential and it's ideal for anyone who wants to make a bigger impact in their life and workplace. On a practical level, I step participants through this framework in keynotes, masterclasses and mentoring sessions so they can truly understand where they've been, where they are now and where they want to go. So how does it work? Let's take a peek under the hood. My framework is based on three time frames. First of all, we have the past. And so the past is where our stories live. And it's these stories where we can find meaning and we can make a deeper connection. Then we have the present. And the present is where we can find clarity about what really matters. And it's here that we can face challenges and turn them into opportunities. And then we have the future. I like the future, because the future is where ideas live. It's where creativity lives. It's also where we can make a difference and add value. So I like to spread this thinking out because when we get into a state of rumination, we regret the past and we're fearful and worry about the future and we get confused and we lose focus about what really matters. But it's possible to lay this thinking out and step back from it in a state of mind wondering where we can learn lessons from our past and we can build confidence to build a vision for a better future for ourselves, our teams, our family and our friends. On the other way, we have three perspectives. The first perspective is A. A is about autonomy. It's about agency, it's about creativity, it's about self. Then we have B, and B is bonding. It's bonding with other people, it's banding together, it's belonging. In a business sense, it's about teams. In a personal sense, it's about family and friends. And then we have C, and C is context. C might be a cause or a calling. Depending on the size of this team, it might be the company or the corporation. If I'm working with a smaller team or a smaller company, then C might be customer, client, or it might even be community. So why is this important? Unfortunately, many of us live here. What's in it for me now? And really what we want to do is get people to focus on what's in it for the team in the future. And then ideally, what's in it for our customers, our clients, our community, or for the corporation in the future. So the way that I run the masterclasses and workshops and mentoring is each one of these squares is a story, is an idea, an insight, comes with illustrations and an exercise, most often using drawing, painting and storytelling. Hopefully you can now see how by the end of the session you'll walk away with new skills and provide a clear perspective about how to add value and make a difference. I would love to work with your team to help unlock the creative potential of your people. Thanks for listening.